Employment and Labor Relations Minister Harun Idrisu has asked the aggrieved teachers to be patient as government resolves their grievances by close of Monday, February 22. Haruna spoke exclusively to TV3 in Accra. To allow for some additional time, a uh, very minimum time, for government to probe further the matter which has been placed before us and to assure the teacher association that government remains very, very committed to the roadmap. And accordingly, we have honored our obligations in respect of the transfer grants, car, motorbikes, and other allowances that they made requests to. The difficulty has to do with validation. And it's a policy decision of government to uh, tighten payroll control and fight payroll fraud and we need the Auditor General to validate any data which is submitted to us as government. The controller will pay subject to the validation by the Auditor General and okay, if that is not received from the Auditor General, controller and the Minister of Finance naturally cannot just uh, 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 approve of uh, payment. There must be basis for the payment. And I'm saying that out of 14,000, we have indeed paid 6,000. There are problems with about 4,000 within the 8,000 that is still been uh, validated and it's just a matter of uh, time uh, they must respect the serenity and sanity of the educational environment particularly for young uh, children who are growing up and keep the industrial peace and harmony of that particular area and continue to dialogue further with government